Hey everybody, and welcome back to another 4x8 gear talk where I take a piece of gear, throw it on a 4x8 sheet of plywood, and uh, just run through it so maybe you can make a better decision on what gear meets your needs for future hunting adventures uh, or anything of the sort. So uh, in front of me today, I have the Mystery Ranch Pop-Up 28, which is a pretty cool little day pack uh, with massive load hauling capabilities. So uh, yeah, this is again, the Pop-Up 28. So about 1700 cubic inches, just shy of five pounds coming in at 4.9 pounds. And this one sits on the pop-up frame, which is a pretty cool system uh, that Mystery Ranch has been tweaking over the past few years. So uh, I'll just kind of dive in and run through the different pockets and stuff like that on the pack and then talk more about the frame. So just on the exterior of the pack, you have one pocket on the back here with a couple of little organizing pockets, just nice for spare small items, knife, tags, anything like that. Uh, you also have a pretty decent sized pocket in the top of the pack's lid where you can fit, you know, beanie, gloves, uh, other small accessories that you might need to jam into there, snacks, all of those types of things. So this one has uh, two zippers, one that runs up each way. I've got um, just a, a sleeping bag jammed in there to fill it up right now. And then you have uh, water bottle pockets on both sides of the pack. So. Now, the interior of the pack itself is just a single pocket. There is, it is hydration compatible, so you do have a bladder pocket on the interior. But other than that, you just have a single, basically a single hole in the bag uh, to be able to jam stuff down into whatever you might need to carry for your day hunt. Uh, what, it, what really makes this pack cool is that pop-up frame. So the whole pack detaches from the frame, just like the majority of the rest of the Mystery Ranch packs. But the difference in this one is rather than having the guide light MT frame, which is going to fit uh, your frame size more specifically, and then have an adjustable yoke. This one has an adjustable yoke as well as an adjustable frame. So if you're just using it as a day pack and you're not hauling anything, you can have it shrunk down just like this. And then when you get into it, if you shoot something while you're out in the field or need to haul a heavier load, you can pull these pieces here and you can actually slide that frame up uh, to where you need it as a way to basically create a frame and have a much higher frame so those load lifters are gonna hold that load up against your back. The other cool thing about the pop-up frame is if you're hunting with somebody that needs to borrow a pack and they happen to be shorter than you or taller than you, you can adjust that frame size to fit their frame uh, to make the pack more comfortable for them to carry around for the day. So. This one can go all the way down to, I guess I don't know what the overall length is of that, but you can have it extended way up uh, for somebody that's really tall. I would never have it that long uh, for me personally, even if I'm hauling a heavy load, just because the physics don't work that well, but somewhere right in there and then be able to clamp that back down, set my load on the load shelf in between, pull the pack back over, strap it down uh, around the sides to hold that load nice and tight and uh, be able to haul out deer, elk, moose quarter, whatever I need to right here on this pop-up frame uh, and then still have the ability to shrink that way down into just my day pack. So yeah, that is the Mystery Ranch pop-up 28. Just an awesome little day pack, um, again, with the capability to haul loads. So if you're looking for something, uh, if you're mostly hunting, you know, doing day trips out of base camp, definitely take a look at the pop-up 28. There is also a pop-up 38 that I'll do another video on, uh, just a little bit larger pack, some different accessory options, uh, but on the same pop-up frame. But yeah, if you like this video, be sure to like and subscribe. It helps us a ton with the YouTube algorithm. Uh, and if you have uh, any other thoughts or questions about the pop-up 28, be sure to comment below. And if there's other gear, things that you would like to see from us, whether it be related to backpacks, camping gear, tents, uh, photography, you name it. Uh, collectively, Josh and I have spent, I don't know how many nights in the woods, but total gearheads and would love to uh, help you out, make better decisions on what gear is gonna work best for you. So that's it for this four by eight gear talk. Uh, gonna figure out what to talk about next and then do that. So we'll see you on the